Hey everyone, Coach Powers, and today I want to talk about NAD infusions and are they helpful? A lot of people ask me this, you know, do NAD infusions help? First, what is an NAD infusion, right? Well, essentially what it is, it's an infusion of a substance that um, that helps it kind of increase the en certain enzymes in your body that can have a, a really powerful impact on sort of functions and recovery and repair of even DNA. That's what they claim anyway, DNA repair damage. Um, not entirely sure of that. I'm not sure if it works on a DNA level, but NAD infusion is can be very powerful. I mean, it, it definitely can be very powerful and has a lot of promise in it. I've seen people um, have really great reactions to it and results. Again, especially post-benzo, it's used in preventative medicine, regenerative medicine. Um, there's something to it. I mean, look, there's something to having the right nutrients in diet and minerals and all of that in our body right there's i mean it's very very important and we don't get enough of that there's a lot of things that we don't get like copper or magnesium and especially if you're not eating the right food you're not getting a lot of that so you're almost bound to be in some kind of deficit somewhere and so nad, NAD infusions are very interesting um I, i've actually seen them be more useful in things like regenerative medicine and uh, you know um, holistic living in that sense. But for benzo people, I will say it's it's been a lot of hit and miss. I've seen people say it was helpful, which then I always wonder how much of that is placebo. And then I've seen people, and probably more times than not, I would say, uh, you know, 25% of people that I've worked with said NAD infusions helped or less, and 75% or more said it didn't. And they were just more upset that they spent so much money on it. But again, you know, these things... You know, it's not a matter of doesn't NAD infusion work or is it helpful or not, but everybody's situation is different, right? I mean, I've seen it be helpful for people in withdrawal and I've seen it not be helpful in withdrawal and I've seen it be very helpful for people post withdrawal, you know, post benzos. And I've seen people say they didn't feel like it did much at all. I think it's one of those things like a good diet though, where it, you know, if it does help, it helps in a very slow kind of subtle level. I don't think it's really meant to just suddenly turn your symptoms around and you're going to wake up one day like ketamine and say, oh my God, the fog has lifted, you know. Uh, not to say people haven't had that experience. I'm, I'm sure there probably have been people that have had that experience, but it's a, you know, it's a, um, it's a slow process for sure. It works um, there to help change you know, brain health at a cellular, cellular level, cellular Um and that's great. I mean, like I said, nutrients, everything like that. Um, and like I said, pretty safe. I, I really haven't heard any serious side effects or anything. So if you have the money, it might be worth doing, right? They're not uh, They're not cheap. You know, a single dose can cost $500, $1,000, right? So keep that in mind. But yeah, it's worth exploring, guys. That's been my experience with NAD, NAD infusion. Not a miracle cure or anything, but... I think in the big picture of things, if you can afford it um, and you got go to the right place, I think it could be a, a very valuable asset. Sure.